Pointless University Master Shed, with your host, who has an IQ of 180, along with green pubic hair, Bamba Grassgrind. Well, hello, and here we are at Silsden Town Hall, Cobbydale Campus, with an unexpected result from Caitley Cliff Castle Academy for retired lunatics, malcontents and ne'er-do-wells. Sounds of cheering, clapping and gunfire. You've scored a full card on your specialist subject on how to bewilder therapists. However, on your general knowledge round, you passed on one question and made one incorrect answer. So in detail, now, are Caitlin's remarkable answers. Question one was, who, in 1990, said, I do not recognise defeat? You answered, Nelson Mandela Chiropodists. Sounds of applause, cheering and heavy slurping. Question two was, what's the difference between a buffalo and a bison? You answered, you can't wash your feet in a buffalo. Question three was, who in 1945 said, what the hell was that? You answered, the Lord Mayor of Hiroshima. Shouts, shouts of remember Pearl Harbour. Question four was, which champion boxer won two fights in the same day, then messed in the ring? You answered correctly, last year's champion at Crofts. Question five was, who said we shall fight them on the beaches? You answered, Mods and Rockers, Brighton, 1963. Shouts of, who's the daddy? Question six was, what did the Duke of Wellington say when he was interrupted on the toilet during the Battle of Waterloo? You answered, I've started, so I'll finish. Sounds of foot stamping, cheering and sporadic machine gun fire. Ahem, can the Keithley fan contingent please vacate the bar and retake their seats? Jeers, boos and yells of killjoy. Hmm, question seven. When asked, what's a Royal Enfield? You answered, it's where the Queen keeps her chickens. Big yells of, go on lads, they're smashing it. Question eight was, what was Gandhi's first name? You answered, goosey goosey. Question 9, on religion, you were asked, what's a Hindu? You answered, it lays eggs. Go on, Keithley. Question 10, you were asked, why was Barbara Windsor turned down for a part in Twin Peaks? You answered, age and gravity. Laughter and a snide one saying, stop messing about. Question 11, you were asked, what is the name of the notorious route through the Hindu Kush Himalayas? between Afghanistan and Pakistan, known as the Khyber Wat. You said pass, and this was your only pass of the round. Yells of idiot, get an atlas, and sounds of chairs being ripped up. Question 12. You were asked, the American painter, whose various styles encapsulated abstract expressionism, expressionism and action painting, and who died in 1956 in a range of paintings known as... You answered... Pollux, which was deemed offensive and is your only incorrect answer. Calls of clot, that's the painter's name, Thicko. Question 13 was, why shouldn't you wear Soviet era underpants? You answered, Chernobyl fallout. Hoops of delight and sounds of ring pulls hissing. Question 14, you were asked to define manual labour and you answered, he was a Mexican socialist. Size from grass growing. And, fi and, and finally, question 15. You were asked, which Yorkshire captain toured Australia and never took a wicket? And you answered, Captain Cook. Sounds of cheers, breaking glass. And where's the bar? So, Keithley Academy, you've romped it. Unbelievably, you now go through to the final with Doncaster College for higher education and swamp draining. Unbelievable, incredible, shouts of the referees, a love child. Oh, something similar. And that's all from this week's Pointless University Master Shed. Better call the gendarmes, Quentin, there's a good lad.